for the second time now. The bars are open, y'all. Yeah. Yeah. The state is reopening Florida bars at 50% capacity. I'm excited. I mean, it's been, you know, getting to this point has taken a really long time for all of us. Obviously, we all want safety first. Stephen Shred owns several bars in Tampa and St. Pete. They were shut down when both bars and restaurants were ordered to close, but have been able to operate in the past months because they have a food license. Shred says they'll keep the safety measures they put into place. Whether it's COVID or not, we want people to feel safe and welcomed at all times. But some locations like Crowbar and Ybor City went dark on March 16th and have had to stay that way. But at the same time, that doesn't reimburse us for all the the money we're out. Tom DeGeorge is the spot's owner. He's out over $100,000 and just spent another 2000 to get a food license so he wouldn't have to stay closed. The news from the state hasn't hit a good note. Would you say that you're happy but frustrated? Yeah, I'm frustrated. I've been frustrated this whole time. We were changing our licenses over because they told us if we didn't that we should expect to be closed till January. While he and more than three dozen other live venues in the Bay Area wait for someone to step in and help, bars will be ready to go next week. Monday is not, it's not that far away, but we'll be prepared.